Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. My name is Crazy Xcoder. We're going to go for a brief overview of all the tools in Illustrator. After this tutorial, we're going to be able to pretty much be acquaintance with all the tools and um we're going to later explore their use. As you can see, I'm clicking along the toolbar, which is our toolbox in Illustrator CS5. And um the main goal of this tutorial is that you click around and um, try to learn the shortcuts. They become very handy when you're working around like with with layers. Remember the shortcuts for your layers. Learn your shortcuts for your pointer tool, your text tool. And if you just hover with your mouse on, and on top of the tool, you're going to get the name of the tool. Pretty much you can aid yourself of your textbook and learn the names by heart if you want to be a successful designer. You see how I'm toggling here between colors. Use the X to toggle in between gradient colors. So okay, let's start with the tool. That's V A Y. That's L. That's the pen tool. P ticks tool. T rectangle brush pencil eraser rotate with mesh tool gradient tool which is G the picker or the eyedropper then you have the spray the slice tool the hand tool and to alternate you're clicking around you see the how can you modify points thickness of the line types of the line textures of the line styles this can be applied to any pattern. Remember the Illustrator is a vector-based program. That means it's resolution independent, which you can blow the size of the billboard and it's not going to pixelate. That's the difference is Photoshop to present pixelation because it's pretty much pixel-based. Um, get acquaintance over there. With the automation scripts a little quick with the environment designer essentials the different types notice how to change It's all the different environments that we can have handy here in Illustrator. You can resize panels. You see all the little arrows in there, that means that there's more, so you can collapse panels to the left, to the right. It's just to have more white space for you to design better. You can sign in to your Adobe account. There's a whole bunch of cool stuff you can do. Illustrator is definitely one of my favorite programs to work in. All right, but just click, keep clicking around until you get familiar with the environment. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.